Yo, what is up guys? In this video, we're going to talk about how to wall bounce like a pro or like how Phantoms bounces. This is more of the reason why I kind of stopped doing wall bounce videos because once I found out about this method, um, I got into my head saying like, why should I waste my time trying to bounce, putting all this effort while people just literally use macros to bounce and they do like the same shit as me. So I kind of moved away from the wall bounce type of videos and went towards more of like sniper or feeds, I would say. So in this video, we're going to teach you how to make wall bounce like Venoms. I found this program called Rewaz. And it will be this one. Okay, so configure. I don't know how to do this. This is like my first time doing this, so... Hopefully you don't, hopefully it just installs rewalls and nothing else. Okay, so I have to restart my PC. I'll be right back. Once you restart your PC, you should be able to open it now, I think. Okay, good. Okay, after watching a video, I think I found out how to do it. So, no supe cómo usar este programa, pero ahorita terminé de ver un video. So what you do is you click on add. Um, you could just do gears. Now, once you do gears, this should pop up. And the, the, for example, we're gonna use A for wall bounce. You click A, rewalls or mapping, and you're gonna do whichever key I wanna use. But I, I'm, we're gonna use this right here. Remove here and then do that. So in el juego, vamos a abrir el juego donde dice take cover y manto. Cambiamos el mismo botón donde click. El mismo botón que usaste en este se va a usar para el secondary. So para mí, yo usé este. Ustedes pueden usar lo que sea. Nomás yo escogí este. So lo mismo en es aquí. So now I'm guessing this is a word. What the fuck? Oh. Okay. <laughs> so you click apply. Pass para atrás al juego, and then you just hold A, and it bounces for you. As you can see, I'm using classic alts, and nothing's remap. Y lo único que puse es el mismo donde haces el wall bounce, está aquí. So, you just hold A. And it does it for you. And the way to find out if people are using this method is when, you're, when they're bouncing and when they try to go and switch weapons. You can see how... It spazzes out as if you're trying to get into mouse and keyboard because that output right there is mouse, the one to the side, and the one in the middle is controller. So if you see that spazzing out whenever someone is trying to switch weapons, they're using a macro to wall bounce. Okay, so when ustedes están viendo, um, Cuando está así el UI en medio de la pantalla es cuando estás usando control y cuando está en el left side de la pantalla es cuando están usando con uh, teclado. So cuando ustedes ven videos donde hay gente que por, por ejemplo cambia el arma cuando está haciendo wallbomb y se cambia a los dos es que están usando como un tipo de macro para hacer el wallbomb sin control. Obvio, hay personas que pueden hacer wall bounce como así lo que estoy haciendo. Porque no importa si usas macro o no, el movimiento siempre va a ser lo mismo. Siempre va a haber una, un cap, por decir, de cómo rápido puede hacer tu. puede ir tu character. Es como, por ejemplo, Phenoms puede hacer este wall bounce, el mismo speed que yo, y él no usa macro porque él anda en consola. No más esto lo hace más, um, por decir, más fácil. 
para que gente lo use. So, you guys know how fast Phenoms is. Um, Phenoms is the exact same speed as a macro bounce, but the thing is, he doesn't use a macro. It's just, in this game, you could only, it doesn't matter how fast you are, there's going to be a limit on how fast your character moves and camera. So, for example, someone could replicate this bounce without a macro. But the thing, the reason why I'm showing this method is because there's a handful of people who could bounce this fast legit compared to how many people there are that make bouncing videos going the same speed while they use macros. And obviously, once your trial runs out, you could always uninstall the um, the application, then install it again, and you should have it. Or unless you just want to pay the seven dollars. Obvio, cuando se termina el trial de tu del turbo del rewards, pueden desinstalar, creo que así se dice, a la aplicación, luego instalarla otra vez y puedes agarrar el trial de nuevo. No más. Trata de ver que si borraste toda la programa correcta. Mm. 